married to a drug dealer. When I was with the drug dealer, he controlled me. He controlled me with mind games, with physical abuse, with holding money, with holding love, with holding everything. He controlled me. He did whatever he wanted to do to control me, to put me under su submission. Why do we control people? We control people. We shouldn't have control over people. The Bible says in the book of Psalms, chapter 24, verse 1 and 2, The earth is the Lord's and all its fullness, the world and all those who dwell therein. For He has founded it upon the sea and established it upon the waters. People don't belong to you. People don't belong to me. When I married my second husband, the one, the husband that God intended me to do, there was a lot of times where I didn't get my way. I wanted to get my way, so I wanted to control him. Now physically, he was way out of my league. There was no way I was going to control him. So I tried to control him other, in other ways. I withheld my love with him. I withheld talking to him. I would ignore him for a day or two, hoping to get my way. Most of the time it didn't work. But I was trying to control a human. We control our children. We tell them what to do, we teach them right and, right, right and wrong, and those things are the right thing to do. The Bible says, spare the rod, spoil the child, and I listen to the Bible. But there's a difference between teaching a child and controlling a child. The Bible says in Colossians and other places, Colossians, Chapter 3, verse 21, you should read it. Fathers, do not provoke your children, lest they become discouraged. We shouldn't be controlling our children. We help them to grow and learn in the Lord. But not control them, not discourage them. You say, I'm not controlling no person. Are you? Are you ignoring them, withholding love from them, abusing them, being ugly to them, talking about them? It's a hard habit to break. We shouldn't be trying to control any human, any human. Not children, not spouses, not bosses, any human. They all belong to the Lord. Think about it.